Hello again, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome back to Call to Arms Operation Maneuver, taking place in 1986 here in the Soviet invasion of Afghanistan. If you want to see more of this, make sure you go ahead and blow up that like button to vote to see more Call to Arms on the channel. Make your voice heard. If you want to download this one again, the Russ Star Mod is available for you in the description. So look for the Google document that links to all Call to Arms mods. We have ourselves uh, some Soviet forces here that are about to be ambushed in this mountain valley by enemy forces. We're going to go ahead and get started by setting up a uh, defense here. And uh, we're about to lose a chopper, I think, by an enemy ambush. This one didn't leave in time. I think they're unloading supplies, but too little, too late. There she goes. All right, all troops to defensive positions. We're going to have to hold for about 15 minutes here, so get settled in as we uh, try to survive during Operation Maneuver and uh, try to uh, eliminate enemy forces. We're going to try to set up a perimeter on this higher ground here. And let's see if we can get our boys down. There we go. Everyone's kind of retreating to cover. Perfect. All right, let's get on some of those machine gunners. Let's head over to this uh, pile of supplies here and see if we can knock down some of these enemy defenders. Definitely got some guys here. Wow, look at that guy getting blown back. We know there's some guys on the other side of the bush. Pin them down, boys. Keep their heads down. All right, we have to hold here for 15 minutes against constant enemy attacks. There's really no cover, and we're surrounded by all sides. It's going to be a bad day here, I think. A real bad day. At least for the enemy. All right, we have RPGs, we have troops with, uh, like, rocket launchers, radio, sniper rifles, machine guns. It's going to be a hell of a defense. And like I said, there's really nowhere for us to hide. All right, let's go ahead and try to spread out a little bit. All right. Try to get some of our men to cover. All right, boys. All right, reinforcements arrive in about 15 minutes. So all we need to do is just not die is our mission objective. Get all of our troops to cover. There we go. All right. Well, we're near supply if we need it. And uh, one of our choppers is down. I don't think we can salvage anything from that. We just need to make sure that uh, enemy forces here uh, don't get anywhere near us. There we go. So again, this uh, mission series you may remember from the uh, Afghan War mod for uh, Men of War Assault Squad 2, but that's been, uh, I think, deactivated and is now available as the Russ Star mod for uh, Colt Arms, which you can play uh, taking place from 1979 all the way up to uh, modern-day Russia. So it uh, features a lot of different, uh, one false campaign, one fictional campaign uh, featuring uh, a nuclear weapons company and also uh, Afghanistan missions from actual history. All right, we haven't lost anybody yet, but it's not going to be too long until we take our uh, our losses from our forces. We're getting hit from all sides. Northwest, west, and east is primarily where the enemy forces are coming in from. Our machine gunner here is taking too much of a break. Let's go, boy. Where's the enemy at? Look for movement. Oh, there's a lot of shots. Those can't be enemy fighters there. Oh, well, there we go. Finally. There we go. Very nice thing about Call to Arms, you can play it in first person like that, making uh, engagements a lot easier, especially with hardcore mode on. Well, we have yet to lose a soldier. That's amazing. We have taken some wounded, though. Lots of enemy fighters up here. We got our sniper shooting away at them. I'm going to go run over to the... Can the chopper... Is there anything in the chopper? Let's see if we can salvage anything from that. Maybe there's some nice automatic weapons or something we can grab. Okay, nothing at all in the chopper. Oh, this guy's too far away. Come back to the group. Alright, some of our men are even starting to run out of ammunition. Let's head back to those ammo crates. Actually, let's set up a little perimeter over here. Get a little closer to the enemy. Come on, boys, you gotta run. Alright, we're rearming. Okay, we're gonna have to take out some of the troops over here for sure. Stand up. There we go. Take him down. Oh, look at the hit. I think the hitbox of the rock is blocking those guys there. Yeah. All right, well, good. If they can't shoot us and we can't shoot them, we're okay. All right, a lot, a lot of men running out of ammo. 
All right, come on back. Now we have to work on maintaining supply during this firefight. And we are surrounded completely here. Looks like it's not so bad on the eastern side. Only about four guys there, but it looks like a, another wave of reinforcements are coming in. I believe this is Muhajuddin, uh, but it could be many other types of uh, fighters or rebels. Uh, who knows? But if they're this organized and have weapons, it's probably the Muhajuddin. back to cover. Wow, lots of troops running out of ammo. We're about halfway out on one of the ammo crates and about a fourth of the way out on the other one. You guys are pinned down. Return fire, boys. Don't let them up like that. Well, this guy's a sniper. Here, let's start doing some sniping. Uh, where's the enemy? Here we are. Okay, stand by. Boom. That guy's having a bad day. All right, let's see. Oh, yeah. Wait for it to turn orange before we fire. That's how you know it's going to be a guaranteed hit. All oh, these guys are having a bad day. They're all bowing down to a true pimp. That's me. Yes, bow down before me, my greatness. With a sniper rifle. All right, we got even more riflemen out of ammo. I think primarily now we want to set up defenses around the crates. It's really our only source of cover, and we need ammo. There we go. All right, nine minutes, and we're almost out of ammo completely. All right, anyone who needs to, go ahead and heal up. Okay, let's try a regular uh, Soviet soldier. There we go. All right, another wave coming in from the northwest uh, here. Lots of troops coming down from this valley. We, got, we still got nine minutes left. That's a long time to defend against all these fighters. Wow. Soviets are just hammering away with PKMs, AKs, so much more. Wow, we've taken out a lot of soldiers. We might actually have to run out there and start grabbing some of their weapons at some point. Ammo crate here is almost out. We're down to eight minutes. And this one might be out completely. Call back, my man. I don't think we've taken a single loss here yet. And that's why Soviet forces are uh, so elite here. Okay, I don't know how we're doing on supply, I really don't. I'm gonna send him to that other one though. Alright, ammunition is running critically low. Okay, we got a wounded man over here. Let's see if anybody can uh, pin them. Alright, let's see if we can perform CPR on this guy, get him back up. Okay, we're starting to get ammo again. This guy still seems to be out. This crate must be completely empty. Still seven minutes. Is there any ammo? Try to get those wounded up. Come on, get those wounded up. Oh, there's too many fighters now. I got an idea. Let's try this. Hello. Oh, really? That well, wasn't that great of an explosion. Okay. Wow. Two RPG shots right into those guys. Nothing. All right, we got too many wounded, and we got too many men without ammunition. Things are going to start turning bad now. They're getting too hardcore on this side. I think we're going to have to flee. Look at these guys. Holy crap. Oh, we're out of ammo. 
Oh, this dude's down to just a handgun. Oh, wait. Does he even have ammo? Dude, switch back to your main gun. There we go. Just trying to shoot blindly at this point. Alright, it's Fubar. Get out of there. Came up. Don't want to leave a man, though. Come on, we gotta try to save him. I don't think it's gonna work. We'll try. All right, let's bring up some reinforcements. All right, that man didn't make it. All right, let's help these guys to pull back. All right, everybody, heal up. We got guys down to handguns. At least some of these guys still have grenades. Five minutes. We just gotta make do. Mm, four or five guys down. Six. We landed. We'll be soon. Meanwhile, me uh, mortars are deployed. Oh, good. We got support mortars. Oh, thank goodness. All right, let's go ahead and fire. Uh, right there. Mortars are coming in. Fantastic. Coordinates received. Here comes the mortar strikes. This will lighten things up for us a bit. I don't even know who's alive in there. It looks like a big clump. There we go. Hopefully it rips those guys up. Okay, we'll have to hit over here next. Alright, we're holding okay. Enemy attacks seem to be kind of slowing down. Looks like the next best place. And then maybe over here somewhere. Next to the rock, I suppose. Alright, let's see how the borders function here. Yeah, there we go. Get him, boys. Wait, not as effective as I'd like. It's not really doing anything to those guys at all. I'm gonna just have to come down to the rifleman. Okay, there we go. Get that guy healed up. Okay, we'll go for over here. Yeah, I, I don't even think we killed anybody over here with the mortars. Those explosions should be bigger or more plentiful. Alright, let's just hit here. I, I don't think we're really doing any damage with the mortars, but at least it's it might kill somebody. At least it's on our side, not on theirs. Alright, we're falling back. Leaving some of our men behind, but they're dead there. What the? A piece of rock just exploded and came down here. Is that from over here? Holy crap, we blew the whole rock up. Whoa. Okay, well, there goes that cover. Uh-oh. It's like flipping the light on and seeing all the cockroaches run under the fridge. Oh, let's hit that area again. All right, more enemy reinforcements coming in. We got two minutes. All right, let's hold the line. Yeah, this guy has no ammo. Everybody's out of ammo. This guy's just, his health is just being deleted. Where's the enemy at? I can't even see. There we go. Keep pinning them down, boys. Oh, that kid, I can't believe that was in the hit. Osama! The hell? What are you doing here? Oh, no, you don't. Don't you even try. Oh! Alright. Well, we still have mortar fire, but it's still ineffective. It's not really doing anything. We've got a minute and 30 something seconds. Just gotta stay in cover. Oh! Oh! oh. Okay, get those.
There we go. The mortars hitting yet? Well, these mortars are not very good. Oh, we got about a minute left. Let's go for the health again. Alright, well, this is it. We got one minute and all these troops around here. Let's sit there again. Nice concentration. We are out of ammo. We are completely surrounded. 47 seconds remaining. Enemy reinforcements from the east, northeast, northwest, and west. Here comes those mortars again. Oh, there we go. Wow, landed right next to that guy. Look at two mortars next to this dude here. That guy had no, no effect at all. That's a shame. All right, well, we can fire the mortars one more time, but it's just going to come down to Soviet zeal now. Oh man, they're closing in. Large group there. And yeah, the mortar fire is just ineffective. This guy has nothing in terms of ammo. Let's go with the RPG then. Eat this. Alright, here comes the reinforcements. Oh, finally, here we go. Hit the dirt, boys. I hope we have more than that for reinforcements. Capture enemy base is the next objective. This is it for our reinforcements. We're going to need a lot more than this. We don't have ammo. We have a lot of wounded. We need that mortar back online. Oh my goodness. Alright, capture enemy base is our new objective. Um, uh oh. Uh oh, they have two mortars. We already got a man down in this reinforcement squad. Okay, we can't replace men, but we can replace ammunition and weapons, so come on, heal these guys up. There we go. If you could go ahead and, uh,. There we go. Zap his dumb ass. Wow. Well, that's it for the reinforcements. We one one squad. Okay. Great. I was expecting like a, you know, like two squads, multiple vehicles. All right, we're out of supply. Like, there's nothing we can do here. If we don't take all these guys down, we're going to get capped. So we're going to have to probably take some time to uh, finish off all these guys and then eventually uh, grab all their weapons. All right, there we go. Is there any supply cache around here? I think, how are we even going to attack this base? Hmm. All right, well, going through this valley is going to be a no-go. Um... Look at that. All the, oh, it's one avenue of attack. There's no way around it. we got to go, like, straight in. We have to get over these hills somehow and get to the to a path. There's really, like, no roads in this place at all. Look at all the men out of ammunition. Let's separate them from the main group and find out who needs ammo. Maybe we'll get something if... Uh, If we finish these defenders off, or these uh, attackers, maybe we'll get something. Right, some of these guys do have ammo. Wait, now they do have ammo. Alright, another guy down. Well, we still got about 30 dudes to finish off. We faced worse odds before. Just gotta keep using those medics. Oh, we're just completely surrounded. This is going to take a while to clean up. 
We have to go this way too, so they're, st they're literally standing in front of where we have to go. Like, we have to go right here to this somewhat road. That's where we gotta get to. Uh, we are out of like medical supplies. Well, while we wait for these guys, let's grab some more. Uh, let's grab some ammo from these guys. Some guns. We'll renew the fight. So, in uh, Call to Arms, by the way, when a troop picks up a uh, a trooper picks up a weapon, they get all the ammo with it as well. So you don't have to grab ammunition separately. So, for example, if someone swings over and picks up a PKM, they get to pick up the whole thing. That's not going to work. Uh, let's see. Well, we have a whole... Uh, come on down to uh, Mujahideen Everything Must Go sale. Look at that. Wow. I don't know how much ammo these weapons even have in them. We need to clean this mess up. we got to get out of here. So in the meantime, we've got uh, several defensive positions. There's no way we can attack this. They literally have machine guns blocking... The only avenue of attack. There's no way we can do this. Alright, there we go. Well, at least we got something to fight with. There we go. Boy, these guys take a lot of hits. Or these weapons suck. Alright, let's get up there even if they don't have guns. Let's find some guns. Looks like this supply crate actually has supply left in it. It's not going to be enough for all these guys, though. Okay, pretty much uh, ready to go here. Alright, we lost maybe 10 men in that attack. Let's see, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... Nine or ten men? Okay, well, not too bad. Whew. Okay, the assault is finally over. All right, now we'll get healed up and we'll get ammo, but well, how are we going to get through this? We've got uh, a Dishka right here with a defensive position. Um, we got more troops that are... What? They have, like, the high, high ground. I think they could shoot down from... Yeah, I think they might be able to shoot down on us from there. Okay, well, let's go ahead and grab all the supply we can. Does everyone have uh, ammo? Or resupply? I think this crate may have had more ammo in it. Alright, I guess not. Well, we got to do a little bit of... Uh, oh, boy. I don't even know what who who's low on ammo. Some people are out. I wish there was an indicator for low ammo. Uh, let's, well, let's just grab a case. If we can. You can hear a lot of these troops are heavily wounded, heavy breathing. There we go. Okay, let's see. Well, everybody seems to have ammo. We can uh, pick it up now as we go on. All right, let's make a couple squads here. Doesn't matter who's in what squad. Let's just mix everyone together. Okay, there we go. So it looks like out of this we have uh, two and a half squads, maybe. Yeah, that's about as best we can do. Everybody's pretty much out of medical kits. We can take our time to grab it all from the enemy, but we don't have that kind of time. Some of our groups are on, like, hold fire. No, put everyone on open fire. So much for those reinforcements. These guys in the helicopters did everything themselves. The helicopters um, were necessary to get the troops here, but the... Uh, Troops inside them are the ones who finished that off. The reinforcements really didn't do anything. All right, let's get up this hill then. Wow, what a defense. Okay, we still got some wounded, but people are going to have to attack. I can see this going to be uh, a long mission. There's a lot to do here. We've got to get through uh, multiple mortars, multiple anti-aircraft units. There's got to be some other way into that base. There's got to be like a back door or something. But in front of us is uh, Gargantuan Mountains. And uh, cliff faces and stuff, I don't even think we can get over. 
Um, that's going to be a tough time, unless perhaps we get some reinforcements as we approach the base. That is going to be it for today's episode, everyone. We will see the assault of the base next time. It's going to take a lot of finesse to do this. So I'll see you all in the next mission here for Call to Arms with the Rust Star mod. I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.